so this weekend I was named a 2019 Rhodes Scholar. That means the world to me. I'm still trying to process it because the same weekend you interview is the same weekend they tell you whether or not you're named a Rhodes Scholar. So to have gone through that entire process and then to be named one has been an, um, it's an opportunity of a lifetime. I'm passionate about solving patterns of forced displacement. I'm passionate about helping refugees and women specifically obtain an education. And I'm passionate about solving uh, inequalities when it comes to access to education. So I'm hoping that through the different programs that Oxford has to offer, I could achieve my goal of deepening my understanding of those different issues and problems that our world is facing right now. I don't ever believe in speaking for a group of people. I believe in giving them the platform to speak for themselves and I think this will definitely provide me with that opportunity. Being at UK has showed me that if you have one person who believes in you, that's sufficient and I've had a lot more than one. I've had dozens of faculty, dozens of mentors. It makes me really grateful to be at this campus. You know, it, it takes a village to build one person and I'm, I'm always going to be thankful for, for my community for believing me in the way that they did. I want to say thank you to UK, to Mama and Baba, to my brothers, to Hanin, to Nama, and to the rest of my friends and mentors on this university campus for helping me in the way that they did.